When Haruki Murakami entered Waseda University, he entered the Wakajuku Dormitory. He wrote the following about that time. When I entered university in 1986, I was admitted to a student dormitory in Mejuro. I lived there for six months, but in the fall of that year I was thrown out for bad behavior. The owner of the dormitory was a right-winger, and the dormitory director was a creepy old man from the Nakano School of the Army. Wakajuku is a men's dormitory in Mejuro. It is not a dormitory of any particular university, but students from various universities can enter. Let's compare Wakajuku with the dormitories that appear in the work. First, let's look at the description of the dormitory. Located on a hill with open views in the middle of the city, the dormitory compound sat on a large quadrangle surrounded by a concrete wall. A huge, towering Zell Kavitri stood just inside the front gate. This Wakajuku is located in Mejuro, on a hill with a great view of the city. It is surrounded by a high concrete wall. After passing through the main gate, you see a huge tree, not a Zell Kava, but a towering one. In the work, it says, behind the common building there was a field used for baseball and soccer, and six tennis courts. There is only one tennis court, but there is a ground for baseball and soccer. Let's take a look at the common building. It says, a common building, the first floor of which contained a dining hall and bath facility, the second consisting of an auditorium, meeting rooms, and even guest rooms. Except for the guest room, the rest is correct. There is also a similarity in the spirit in which the dormitory was founded. In the story, it says the proclaimed founding spirit of the dormitory was to strive to nurture human resources of service to the nation through the ultimate in educational fundamentals. As for Wakajuku, it says, the fundamental force that will bring order and happiness to human society is the people who will become the core leaders of society. This dormitory was established to nurture people who possess both the rich intellect and moral qualities necessary to become excellent members of society. Haruki Murakami just summarized it, didn't he? The symbolic feature of the dormitory in the work is the flagpole. In the text, it is written as follows. The flagpole stood in the very center of the compound, where it was visible from every window of all three dormitories. This is the actual location of the flagpole at Wakajuku. It was too high for me to get a good shot of it in one photo. And Haruki Murakami was in the West Dormitory, where he can actually see this flagpole. He was in room 427 on the fourth floor of the West Dormitory, according to an article about Haruki Murakami, in the Asahi newspaper. Incidentally, Haruki Murakami wrote the following about the stormtrooper, who was the roommate in the novel. I don't have a model for 99% of my novels, but I do have a roommate, who stutters a bit in Norwegian wood. He was really my roommate. He was a very serious person. It seems that double rooms were abolished in 1985, at Wakajuku. The main character walks from the dormitory to the streetcar stop when he goes to Kobayashi Bookstore, Midori's house, but the streetcar stop is actually less than 10 minutes walk from Wakajuku. Wazita University's Faculty of Letters, Arts, and Sciences, where Haruki Murakami attended, is located at this location. Let's take a look at the aerial video.